what is going on guys and welcome back to the channel um told you guys that the si is gonna get a lot of uh work done to it and uh i'm out here with uh hayden and i'm out here with uh levi he's all the way over there <laughs> but i needed help with my car because uh some of the things i'm doing isn't gonna be just a one person job and if it is a one person job i don't have the tool to make it a one person job hayden's gonna help me out with a bunch of the stuff and also he's gonna be taking my uh splitters because you always got something different in mind uh so yeah he's gonna be taking off the splitters this is his uh wrx she kind of clean though you know what i'm saying mm, look at that beefy boy fitment Ooh. <laughs> look at them headlights though you know what i'm saying Pretty sick car, not gonna lie, but I'm not a Subaru person because I don't blow head gaskets. <laughs> so, you can take out the front bumper, unbolt this. We're gonna be putting on some new parts. Um, we gotta bleed the brake fluid because at autocross, I'm having brake delete. Um, we're gonna rotate the tires because I've gone to two autocross days and no, three actually on these tires. And two of them have been on dual drivers so the tires have been taking a beating uh, so we're gonna flip them rotate them um, also put on some air ducts I have them over here actually let me just oh, oh oh no oh no okay so here are the air ducts right here carbon fiber from password JDM uh, let's hope I can make these work and then we got our brake fluid right here we're gonna take off the side skirt splitters. Um, and then I got new end plates made. Um, these are stainless steel, got them made. Uh, just gonna paint them black. What else? Um, oh yeah, my rear bumper. It has a little bit of damage right here. I'm gonna try to body fill this if I can. I don't do body work, so if you guys cringe, to any of you guys that do body work, please don't hate on me too much. We're also going to be repainting my canards because these have been seen some wear and tear. I don't know if you guys can see that up close or not. So yeah. So we're going to get started real quick and get this all done. The car is up in the air, kind of. Um, so we're going to rotate the tires. Hayden's taking off the uh, front splitter for me. And then he's going to get to sanding down these, uh, whatever these are called, the canards. Um, I'm having an issue with this side where it's starting to uh, raise up this this side and this happened to me last time before I lowered it so I'm gonna see what's going on um, if anything I'll buy new coils so yeah um, oh yeah I need to take out the rear bumper too shit so gotta take out the rear bumper uh, so yeah we're gonna get to that Hayden got off the front splitter. That was a lot quicker than I thought, bro. Told you, bro. <laughs> All right. So, most of the wheels are off. I don't know why this is happening, guys, but you see that? That should be locked in right here, and it's not. And that concerns me. And it keeps on happening. So, we're gonna close it back up again, put my alignment where it needs to be, and lock it again. Sad. Uh, taking off all the wheels, gonna rotate the tires. Hayden's gonna be sanding these down. I personally think you should let me take these out and paint these black. Why don't you take it out? The hardware. Oh. Like, I think you should let me paint them black. Why? That way it's less noticeable. It doesn't really matter to me. I mean, do you, okay. <laughs> I mean, it's up to you, but I, I can paint them black. So well, I think because it's, it's, it's a small hole to fill in, 
on the Allen head, I think it's gonna kind of fuck with it. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's up to you. Yeah. Uh, so, Levi supervising. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> but yeah. Hey, Tommy. What's up? I'm using the tower cord. Okay. That's five dollars in power. From my house? <laughs> <laughs> so, it's gonna be spinning this until she locks up. Uh oh. <laughs> That's not what I want to hear. That's not supposed to happen. Look at this. My preload is probably off. Oh well, we're getting new port loaders anyways. This is Nocturnal Habits Garage mixed with Cerberus. We are gonna do this. The nocturnal habits with <laughs> Levi, will you give me if you can like a flathead or like a like a just a hammer and something that I can use this to like fuck, or like a chisel. Do you have a chisel? Uh <laughs> I have no idea. But I guess I'm gonna go find something. A uh, hammer. Uh, chisel. Cool. That'll work. Hey, Tommy, will this work? <laughs> I would take out those bolts, though. I had to make it more hard for me. <laughs> okay, I actually have to go find a chisel now. <laughs> I wonder how many things I can bring Tommy that aren't chisels before he gets up and gets it himself. This ought to work. So, I got it, but it keeps on spinning and spinning, so we're like chilling. Um, compare this side to the other side, please. Um, okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't think those are even. It's I, okay. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be fun. <chill. laughs> it's okay. With what? With this. Um, is that what you brought me to use? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me see if I have something in my tool. I can bring you more tools if you want. Because it's really thin. I sprayed it on like shit. I need to find another ridiculous item to bring him. Instead of a chisel. Said a screwdriver will work. We'll bring him a Phillips head. Perfect. Oh yeah, you said a screwdriver will work? Cool. Wait, that's actually gonna work? Oh, I got you a lot. <laughs> you a flat too. <laughs> Sheesh. That's pretty good. Ooh, look at Hayden. My new painter right here. Body work. <laughs> if you guys need body work, <laughs> hit him up. <laughs> pretty smooth now. Uh, just gonna start cleaning it up and spraying it. I'm gonna try to body filler the uh, bumper. We'll see how it goes. Um, car's like totally apart right now, but it's okay. We'll get it done. Hayden's gonna prep the canards for paint. They're already pretty much done. Um, 
yeah make sure you guys do that uh, I'm not a painter so I probably would have just sprayed it uh, <laughs> gotta take rubbing alcohol or something like that to clean it to pick up all the grime nah fuck that it's not turn have its garage we're trying to paint this again in two weeks <laughs> um, Hayden's also gonna body filler this for me so thank you Hayden I've done a couple bumpers in my day <laughs> yeah I don't do the body work stuff um, if you guys were noticing earlier, uh, he was just sanding and this, I was just hammering this. <laughs> He's like a freaking, uh, what is that called? A freaking orbital? Yeah. And you're just over there with, on the suspension. Clank, clank, clank. We are not the same. Yeah, we're not the same. Uh, so, there's some uh, screws down here that hold in my side scare splitter. Probably not the right way to do it, but this is the only way I could do it uh, to make it work for me. Please don't hate me guys, but yeah, my chassis probably hates me though. So yeah, just gonna take all these off. Okay, first coat. Done. So right here is where we need a bondo and sand. Now, this step probably isn't necessary, but I'm gonna still clean it off with some alcohol. That way the bondo binds a little bit easier. Uh, technically it should be fine, but that's what I'm gonna do. Well, Tommy finishes you that up. Do that. I, I have no say in that. <laughs> <laughs> Explain what you're doing. Yeah, um, you're gonna get a this? nice scoop of Frosty from Wendy's. You won't. I fucking won't. Dude. <laughs> you're not down. Dude, this shit smells so bad. It smells so good. <laughs> you can have some if you want some. I mean, you don't need much of this hardener. I probably even used too much right there. I'm just gotta mix this. Oh my god, bro, that smells so freaking bad. It smells like. I don't know what it smells like, but it smells like something. Very informative. <laughs> the way you have with words. <laughs> That's how I get them. <laughs> Dude, I think you're only supposed to have like a. I think you're only supposed to do like a piece size or like a quarter size to every like. Fuck, I forget. <laughs> it says on the direction. So if you're curious, look there. <laughs> so that's pretty much all we're gonna need. Um, what I'll do is now after this dries and cures, I'm gonna sand this down to match all the surrounding area. Okay. And then um, we'll do one more coat, and then we'll sand that too. Okay. And then after that, we can fill it with primer if you wanted to. Yeah. And we'll have to sand that down again too. So this is gonna be a lot of sanding. But like right here, you can see where like uh, there's a couple of bubbles and everything. Yeah. So ideally, we want to get all of that out of there um, in order for it to really be uh, really flush. And then you won't notice it when either you paint it or you wrap it. All right. But yeah. Cool. Now we're just gonna wait for that to dry. I'm still trying to figure out how to use the Dremel, so... <laughs> I fixed it, kind of. I don't want that broken half, I just put it like together. Oh, would you just spit and just... <laughs> See? Oh my god, bro, that's not good, that's gonna fly right off. So? <laughs> what? You're gonna be like, so, and then when it flies at you at a thousand miles an hour, you're gonna be like, oh. <laughs> so, uh, Hayden was looking out for me and told me not to use the Dremel no more. 
I was looking out for myself. <laughs> and we got the jigsaw. Also, Tommy's not allowed to use it. <laughs> you don't trust me. You just broke two blades <laughs> and then was like, put it back together with basically spit and duct tape. <laughs> so, I've been like trying to figure out how to cut this with that Dremel and it wasn't working. So, uh, we're gonna use the jigsaw. Hayden's gonna use the jigsaw. <laughs> oh, Hayden's gonna use the jigsaw because he doesn't trust me. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> All I needed to do was see how you handled that Dremel. <laughs> I realized that you're not power tool certified. Watch okay, so what do we, you want this whole outline? No, let's just start with this first. Just this? Yeah. Okay. This is not gonna fit, but it's okay. Okay, we're gonna cut out this hole. And I think we figured out what we're gonna do. I think so. Kinda ghetto, but it works. All right guys, so call us ghetto. Well, call me ghetto. <laughs> um, so we're just gonna drill a hole in and zip tie it. Uh, hopefully that's not gonna damage anything, but it probably will. Um, and then we're gonna drill a hole right here, and then probably a hole right here, and it's gonna hold it in. Um, this thing doesn't really hold the best fitment, but it's good enough for me. Um, so we got this right here. There's the little gaps, but I don't think you're gonna notice it too much. So we'll be okay. So yeah, let's do it. All right, so Hayden's gonna be sanding down this. Sorry guys, we're uh, like really like going back and forth between jobs because like- Stuff needs time to dry. Yeah, stuff needs time to dry, stuff needs time to get sprayed, stuff needs to be sanded down, stuff needs to be drilled, stuff needs to be done. <laughs> so I yeah. I need to be stuffed. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Come on. So we're just gonna be sanding that uh, and then re putting on another layer of uh, body filler and then we're gonna primer it. So it should be pretty simple, guys. I think we're pretty much good. I don't know if I have to do a second coat of body filler because everything is smooth. I just wanna go over it and make sure that like, you don't feel any rises or anything. So I'm gonna hit it with some alcohol just to make sure. That looks pretty good. Yeah. Still some of this uh, this showing, but this is okay because it's the same level as the paint. So honestly, uh, as soon as it goes to get wrapped, painted, whatever. So Hayden primered it. A little bit runny, but it's okay because we're gonna sand it again. Yeah, we're gonna sand it and then we'll hit it a couple more. I didn't even mean, I didn't mean to get it runny, but we'll sand it down. We'll hit it with another coat and then we'll probably sand it one more time. With probably this is I think. 220, I think. Uh, one. Oh, that's 150, so we'll hit it with 220 next, and then I think I got a 360. Cool. So we'll, oh. What we decided to do was make some holes, or, or some dots, and we're gonna zip tie this bitch on. <laughs> uh, how you want me to hold it? Yeah, I'm right there. All right. Let's go. Watch your feet. How does it look from the inside? Looks good. No okay. cracks. Good. Cool. Let me uh, get a bigger bit for the zip tie actually. So, pretty much, we're just gonna keep on going bigger and bigger until the zip tie fits through, and we'll be set. All right, guys, it's not pretty, but it works. <laughs> Zip tie technician putting the 240 knowledge into the Civic. So this is what it looks like, guys. It looks so good. It doesn't fit amazing, but like it's because this is meant for no front lip, and I'm we're gonna rock it with a front lip. So yeah. But guys, it looks so good. Look at that. Jesus. Ultimate attack mode. Maximum attack. Ooh, I love it. I love it. Big shout out to Hayden. Helping me out with pretty much all of this. Oh, bro. So he just put on the last coat and it looks so much better. Uh, I remember when I did this on my own. 
fucking ass. <laughs> so, last coat, and then what else do we got? Uh, other than that, I can rinse in the primer from the bumper, but other than that, like, it's pretty good. Ah, oh, shit. I know what we forgot. What well, I forgot. I forgot to take off the end plates. Oh, yeah, we can do that real quick. Yeah. All right, I'll, I'll get on to taking off the end plates. And then. Yeah, she's pretty much done. She's yeah. Ready. Cool. Big shout out to Aiden. All right, guys. It's We're really running out of daylight. We're probably going to have to finish this tomorrow. But I'm going to put on the front bumper. Uh, the rear bumper's already on. End plates are off. We still got to bleed the brakes, so we're going to do that real quick. Uh, if you guys didn't know, all you guys got to do. Pump the brakes, have someone sit in, have them hold the brake, use the bleeder screw, and just do it. I can't record it, because I'm trying to get it done real quick, so sorry guys, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right guys, so I forgot my uh, camera, and I'm doing this off my phone, so yeah. Uh, Aiden is finishing the uh, end plate, and uh, the car looks pretty good. Uh, blue bumper still, but it's chilling. <laughs> um, so it is just pretty much gonna finish that and I'm just gonna install them whenever they're dry. So yeah, I'm pretty stoked. Uh, the SI is getting more and more ready for its new wrap. I hope you guys stay tuned for that and I hope you guys are excited for that because it's gonna be baller. And um, I actually just got a new set of wheels shipped to my house and I'm gonna let you guys guess what they are because they're pretty baller. But other than that, I think I don't really need to continue this vlog anymore. Um, just because I'm just gonna be installing it. The end plate is just like three Allen keys. <laughs> three Allen keys. And yeah, that's about it. So I hope you guys are staying safe. I hope you guys are staying clean and just stay inspired to inspire others. See you guys later.